and then let's go to CMG launcher and let's find our case which is now here CO2 injection hysteresis dot that okay but yeah so I will touch this one and then I will just drag and drop it to our machine which is gem our simulation machine Okay, so again, job process settings, number of processes four, submit to scheduler local. This is the sub simulator version, priority, and everything else we will maintain as it is. And then we can click calculate. Okay, so after running on the gem, if you right click and click refresh, we have in our logger the second row. Okay, then the ID, second project name, default folder, and the job name is CO2 injection for hysteresis. Everything else like this one. Okay, so we can touch this one and we can look at the view log file. Okay. from the week one down to week this one. Total number of time steps, Newton cycles, sulfur, sulfur iterations, and others. Material balance error and others. So this is the result actually, okay? Time step, maximum changes, and the error, okay? So by having this log, it means that our simple simulation, the computation is quite smooth. Everything is good. So now we can just visualize and present the result. I can minimize this one. All right. And we still have our results opened here. Okay. All right, and if we go to data sources, here is our data, all right, and we can click this button, add files, and then we will find our result, and uh, the file will be .sr3, which is this one, okay, we will call this one CO2 injection hysteresis .sr3. SR3, the result file. Now we have two files. Okay, the base file, the, the file, the exercise with only the uh, structural trapping and the file with this one, hysteresis trapping. Okay, and if you look at the reservoir section, we have this one, the visualization for base case. CO2 injection and for CO2 injection hysteresis. Okay. And what we will do is actually touch this one and then drag and drop at the dashboard. Okay. So inside the dashboard, we will have this one as the base. This is the visualization of the base case CO2 injection. And we will do the same thing for IK2D view from exercise with hex hysteresis. I touch this one, drag and drop on the dashboard. So I will have two windows like this one. The left one, the CO2 injection base case. And the, the right one is CO2 injection base case, structural trapping plus hysteresis trapping okay so far so good here we can right click gas saturation and also on the right right click we also show the gas saturation okay so 
gas saturation and then gas saturation as well yeah this is only the effect of coloring yeah so the the highest level will be color colored red but for this one will be colored green so let's check if we can change the color color scale editor touch this one edit point color let's change it to this one click ok click ok okay should we try again okay all right yeah just we can maintain this one just to maybe to differentiate between this plot and this plot okay so we can go to display all right we can click this one so you can track the movement of co2 plume 